sector ambassador is someone that has real pride and passion for the industry in which they work. Somebody that is knowledgeable in all the things that they do within that sector and is able to convey all of those things to young, bright people in terms of looking at this sector as a career. The activities offered by sector ambassadors to schools and colleges are wide ranging, from strategic elements to school planning, school lessons and even school assemblies where ambassadors will come into your environment and give you the pride and passion that they have in their industry. As well as that, there's other strategic elements such as uh, careers fairs. So what are the benefits for schools and young people to have sector ambassadors? Within the agriculture industry, there are loads of opportunities that young people just don't get to see. Agriculture is quite a hands-on uh, business. As a result, ambassadors can connect you with those industries and those practical skills in which you'll need to further your young careers. Sector ambassadors are effective across any industry. So the benefits of this work to employers are not always straightforward to see. Young people engage with you and get enthused by what you're saying to them. However, the benefits of this are wider ranging and for a strong, sustainable industry, it's really important that we get good young people enthused about what we do and really interested in the jobs that we can provide them. But what other things do you need to consider before becoming involved in this type of work as a sector ambassador? Critically, time is the bigger fa biggest factor in any industry. As a sector ambassador for your industry, what kind of activities do you expect to get involved in? There are strategic elements from a higher level. So for myself within agriculture, I get involved with the Yorkshire Agricultural Society to offer higher level opportunities to schools and colleges to what they can do to, for their children, for their students, in terms of exciting people about what we've got to offer in the career sector. From there, I went to Brightcrop, which is the sector ambassador for agriculture, promoting agriculture into schools and colleges. And for whatever industry you're in, there'll be a sector body or an agency who will help provide this information for you and this guidance in order to get the experience as an ambassador to promote your industry to schools and colleges. So what are my top tips to be an ambassador for your industry? Number one is to have real pride in what you do. Number two is to prioritise your own workload but then give a certain amount of time every month, every week, whatever you can allow to put towards this to get real value. And number three is just to be really prepared. Preparation is key to this. You can have your material ready and give it to schools, young people, colleges in a pre-prepared format. And so that cuts down on the workload and the time you have to commit.